And as we move through the storm, freezing temperatures will stick around today. This weather can be dangerous for those without heat. WCPO 9 News reporter Madeline Audley is live outside the emergency shelter of Northern Kentucky. Madeline, how do things look and most importantly feel out there? Kristen, I wish I could tell you that things feel better uh, from when we checked in a few hours ago, but really they don't. These temperatures are still painful. You're going to notice that uh, that feeling the minute you walk outside. Officials here at the emergency shelter of Northern Kentucky tell me the need for shelters really goes up when we experience cold weather like this. The facility the shelter has here in Covington can house 24 people. That is a reduction as a result of COVID-19. Now, early on in January, when the weather uh, started to get a bit uncomfortable. Officials here quickly realized that this was not going to be enough space. At the time, they were turning away 20 to 25 people a night. So what they did, they opened up Mother of God Church as an overflow shelter. That's over on West 6th Street over in Covington. The church can house up to 49 people and the emergency shelter is getting ready to open up another location later this month. Beyond homeless, the individuals experiencing homelessness, what if you were staying someplace and, and didn't have heat? What if you were staying someplace? This is where house fires happen because people take, they open an oven door, they plug in things, they use kerosene heaters. You know, is there is there a way for us to continue to to improve our response as a community? Now, the shelter can always use your help. If you are in a position to give just $30, we'll shelter one guest for one night. You can donate online. We've got the link there at the bottom of your screen. Live in Covington, Madeline Ottilie, WCPO 9 News.